They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. This is swung out to Eckler. So no gain on the play. And that'll make it second and 10. As a defense, you're more balanced when you're in zone coverage because you're able to keep your eyes on the quarterback and see the play develop in front of you. They're able to keep the quick pass in front of them and stop it right at the line of scrimmage. Looking deep for Adams. And a high throw there as this is knocked away, down to the ground and incomplete. Early in the corner when the defense was keeping on the run, you said offensively they need to open things up, take some shots downfield. Didn't work there, but they did it. Yeah, I'm not going to change my tune now. I still think it's the right play because when you take those shots downfield, you open the eyes of the defense to what you could do to them, and that may open some things up for you offensively. Not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run-pass option. You get the sense that next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? Now the former Oklahoma Sooner, Tress Way, on to punt the football. And a fair catch signal for and take it successfully. 36 yards on the punt with no return. And the Patriots take over. The Pats at the line ready to go. And following that long touchdown pass, a one play drive last time, see if the defense, you know they're ready. They don't want that to happen again. And you would have thought they would have been ready the last time. I mean, that's what you work on all the time. Make sure that no one gets behind you. That's the cardinal sin of defense, not giving up the long pass. They did. Let's see how they adjust. After the pickup of five, here's second and five. They'll keep it on the ground again here. And obviously not fooling anybody here as they stop him behind the line of scrimmage. A loss on that play, and now third down gets tougher. Third and six. Once again, they'll keep it on the ground. And brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. So at halftime, it's the Patriots with the advantage. As we send you to our EA Studios in Orlando, here's Jonathan Coachman with our EA Sports Halftime Report. The Chargers going to get the football first here in the second half, and they trail as we get back underway. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. Charger drive about to get going. And they have a mountainous deficit looming in front of them. It was really, Charles, a disaster of a first half. So where do they go from here? Well, first thing they have to remember is that what's done is done, and there's no going back. And now you have to play this drive by drive. Obviously, come back in this spot, pretty unlikely. But you still have to go out, take pride in your work, and try and put something together here in the second half. And my goodness, another interception. Picked off around the 27. And nearly a touchdown as they finally stop him down at about the three-yard line. The first half did not go their way, and that's not going to help matters at all. An interception here on the opening drive of the third quarter. Obviously not what they were striving to accomplish, but you know who's really upset on their team? The defense. Already trailing. They're going to be counted on to try and hold that score at least where it is. Now that sends them two yards in the wrong direction and leads to second down. Halfway home from the four down to the two yard line. Two straight shots on the ground. Now on third, do you go to the air? I think the possibility exists, and if you're doing it, you're probably going play action since you ran it twice. 
But I often think that second down is a time you go play action and throw the ball. I say commit to the run and think about it being four down territory. And this is going to depend on the spot, but I believe he might be a few inches short. It'll be called a gain of two, and that'll leave him with some options here on fourth and inches. And for the second time tonight, this field goal unit comes out here. From the left hash, you'll have to cut this at a tight angle. Butker's kick here is good. And they're well on their way now as the lead grows even larger. So Tack on 